Through this video, we will be looking at how we will gather evidence using our new regulatory approach. Although we will be assessing the evidence using a different framework, most of the information we consider will be similar to what we have been looking at in the past. The evidence we use in our assessments of quality may be gathered through both on-site and off-site methods. On-site activity remains really important, and we expect to use our time visiting services in a more targeted way. For example, observing care and how staff interact with people, observing the environment, including equipment and premises, or speaking to the people who use the service, the staff and the service leaders. We may carry out a site visit to collect evidence without giving notice beforehand. We would do this, for example, in response to a specific concern. We will continue to use and develop insight from national data collections, particularly where there are nationally agreed measures of quality. We will also ask providers to submit evidence when we need it. By bringing together all of the relevant evidence for a specific evidence category, we will then make a judgment based on the requirements of the quality statement and the new scoring scale, taking into consideration the quality and validity of the evidence and whether the evidence sufficiently covers the scope of the service. There isn't a full list of evidence that fits every service. We may need to follow up specific risks or circumstances that would need particular evidence. We do not want providers to prepare specific documents. Rather, we ask for information that they already have. Visit our website for further information on how we will gather evidence and further information on the new approach. Look out for more videos in this series that introduce other elements of our new regulatory approach.